Hi everyone, today we're gonna to talk about the best stocks to buy now for the COVID vaccine that's coming out. I wanted to give you a little bit different look than all the EV stocks we always talk about. So today I wanted to pick four companies from four different kind of industries to give somebody to give you something to think about moving forward. And these are stocks that I do own and I do think will do well for me going forward. And let's stick around. I think you're gonna like what I got for you. For those new to the channel, I am Stock Mo. I'm an old stockbroker and financial planner. Now comes on here, and you know I teach high school, college level investing, and all that other good stuff. But you know what? At the end of the day, I'm just here to have fun and trying to make some money. And today, I want to talk about some wonderful stocks that I think have a great opportunity to take advantage of the COVID vaccine. Now, before we get into that, all I ask you to do. Hit the subscribe button, look down below into the description. You're gonna see two links. You're gonna see one for my Patreon over there where I have all my portfolios. Through over 3,000 members now strong. We are there, I love the support. And of course, I have the Weeble link down below where you get three free stocks. Once you deposit $100, they'll give you two between eight, $8 and $1,600. And then one of them, I don't know, I think it's like $2 up to a couple hundred bucks. So you never know what you're gonna get. So scratching the lottery ticket, you already are a winner because they're already gonna be up. You're not gonna lose anything. So it gives you a new account to have some fun with, and maybe you can buy some of these stocks and maybe we'll turn it in even more. So let's go ahead and get started and see where we're going with this. Now, I wanted to pick four good stocks to take advantage of this whole COVID vaccine run we're going to see. So we're gonna see a lot of different companies coming out talking about their vaccine results, and they're gonna be positive. I have a good feeling that a lot of these companies are gonna come out and do similar stuff that Pfizer just did, and they're going, their stocks will probably take off. But we're not here to talk about the, the companies that actually make the vaccines. We're gonna talk about the four companies I think are important moving forward. When we're talking about the best stocks to buy now for COVID vaccine, these are the ones I'm gonna be discussing. So the first one I wanna talk about is uh, Norwegian Cruise Lines. Of course, we wanna take a stock and you can see what we're looking at before COVID, where it was. This is where I think the stock can get back to. Yeah, it's not gonna happen overnight. It could take us a good two, three, four, even five years. But in five years, if they can get back up to here, and look where they're at now, $21, back up to almost 60. That's triple your money in five years. Now, I don't know how long it's gonna take for that increase. It only took a couple months to get down to here. And you can see they tried to make that big return and then a lot of things went wrong. But now we're at what really is going to help this company. One, we had the cruise lines being allowed to cruise again, as long as they can show safety, that they have the safety to stop COVID. And two, we just had a vaccine announcement. So this is going to help this company big time moving forward and the more and more vaccines that are announced that means more people that will be able to cruise again and they will be able to show some of their safety measures that they could do maybe they pick something that you have to have a vaccine to cruise i don't know what they're going to do but whatever it is that it could give them an opportunity moving forward to make some big money in that industry because i think a lot of there's a pent-up demand there i really like norwegian cruise lines because i like the technical analysis of this you can see the regression lines starting to go the right way. You can see where the top was up there around 60. We can almost put it all together and say, look, in five years, this company should be way back to where it was. Profits should be rolling in. Hopefully they take care of the debt they accumulated surviving this and everything works out well and we're back up to $60 a share. I'm all right waiting three years for this stock to go back up to $60 a share. Tripling my money in five years, I would be happy with that. I don't think it's gonna take that long, but this is why Norwegian Cruise Lines made my, my list of the top stocks to buy now for the COVID vaccine coming out. The next one, of course, another travel stock. This is a travel one, not a cruise, but Delta. I love Delta. I think Delta and Southwest are two of the good stocks out there that I really like to watch. You can see this one up 17% today. We had Norwegian up. Uh, what do we have them? 26.75 today. And then we have, like I said, Delta's up 17 today. So I'm picking stocks that are gonna react favorably to all these COVID announcements coming out. This is not a one and done announcement deal. These stocks have a long way to get back up to here. This one was, we're looking at $63 and right now it's at 36. So I can see Delta getting quicker at the rebound than the cruise lines because I think uh, Delta is gonna be able to uh, get some favors with the low oil price. It's gonna help them out with that. I think that's gonna be good stuff for them going forward. And now they're gonna get back to having full demand, I think within the next 12 months. I think this summer is gonna be huge for a lot of travelers. And if it, and 
with these announcements coming out and these vaccines rolling out, they could be rolling out by December. And the sooner these vaccines get out, I think the more these stocks will start to pop just from everybody getting them and willing to travel again. And that is something we need to pay attention to moving forward, as well as the next stimulus package. That is gonna help them as well. So I think Delta has a lot going for it. And if it takes five years to double my money, once again, I would be very happy. I don't think it's gonna take five years, but that is why Delta made my list. The next one's going to be ASB. I love this one. You can see once again, up 15.85. I wanted to have some banking in there and you can see I've been saying this for a while that the financials are where you're gonna to wanna to add a few of them in there. JP Morgan, I think was up double digits today. I love Goldman Sachs, they were up today. So a lot of these stocks I keep saying are gonna recover once we get vaccines and stimulus packages and stuff, you're starting to see that big time. And of course the dangers, uh, I said a long time ago, for the last few weeks is these, these tech stocks had a run up of 80, 90% that in just a few months, and that is a big run up to be, and it concerns me. That concerns me because some of these companies, this kind of fallen as an industry in itself. You could look at the NASDAQ today, it was down in the red one, all the other, the other ones were up 700 points for the Dow, you know. So I'm getting, I'm, I'm, I'm starting to see some sell off from some big tech companies and it is concerning me. So we wanna make sure we're well diversified in these portfolios. ASB gives us a little bit of that with the banking and you can see where they're at, where they could be. And if we actually scroll it out there, you can see how high this stock could get. Uh, and that's pretty high up there. So they have the chance of getting back up to $30 a share roughly. And that would be doubling their stock as well. I'm trying to pick some good stocks that can give you the chance to double your, your investment over the next five years. And this is another one that I'm gonna be holding on to for a while and riding this hopefully all the way back up to around 30 bucks a share and doubling my money. And finally, the last one, it's the land of happiness. This is a stock that I personally think will do very, very well going forward for multiple reasons. I think Disney is definitely one, you can see them up 11.87 today, down about 1% in, in the aftermarket today. So Disney owns all kinds of good properties. They have the parks out in California. They have the parks all over the world. And they also have the Marvel movies, which I think is gonna be huge going forward, bringing in billions of dollars uh, over the next five to 10 years. And of course, we have Disney Plus it is on the TV, which I think is doing fantastic. This company is primed to make some massive moves once we get back to normal operations. And I see some good things. Because when we look at this, this is not one that's going to be one of the ones where we're like, hey, is this gonna double mow in the next five years? I definitely think there's the opportunity for it with their growth that I think is gonna come naturally. But I think at the end of the day, Disney is one of those stocks that once they get their parks rolling again, once they get the movies out there rolling again, you're gonna see some massive money starting to go into this company. And that's one that we do not want to ignore moving forward because I wanna have some big blue chip companies in there. And I, I think Disney gives us that opportunity. So now we talked about four of the best stocks to buy now for the Corona vaccine that coming out. And I gave you some that are a little high risk, especially the travel stocks and the cruise stocks. And then I gave you two that I thought were pretty decent, lower risk. I thought talking about ASB for the bank and Disney as the big uh, conglomerate that owns everything, I thought they were two very lower risk, I should say lower risk, and then two are the higher risk. Put them together, you have nice four stocks to add to any portfolio to give you some good exposure to this this COVID vaccine that is coming out from all these different companies. And as more people get the vaccine who want the vaccine, you will see the numbers of the uh, infection rate start to drop. And when you see that infection rate drop, I'm pretty confident we will never see these kind of numbers again in infection rates. And thus, I think the stock market will finally start to that next big bull run. And we could say we're already kind of starting in now from when we were at the lows back in March. And that is good news for us investors. We have to be patient. You're gonna have down days. You're gonna have some big down days. Be well diversified in your portfolios. Do not just skip over this part of this video. Make sure you're well rounded in your portfolios. If you put all your money in say in the EVs, that could lead to catastrophe for that portfolio if they have a major pullback just because everybody starts profit taking and it drops 20 to 40% like we saw with Tesla, like we saw with DraftKings, like we saw with apps. We saw a lot of companies drop a ton. And if you have all your money in that one or two, three stocks, that can lead to some massive losses and some stomach churning. So I like to add a lot of different stocks in there, be rounded and just think about the future, what's gonna help us going forward. And that is why I'm throwing in 
four good stocks that I think will be affected positively with these vaccines when they're coming out. So hopefully that all makes sense. Remember what I said, if you haven't done it already, hit that, hit that subscribe button over there, I should say, and then take a look down below at the Weeble link. And of course, my Patreon, come on over. We have, like I said, over 3,000, getting closer to 4,000 members. And it is absolutely wonderful. We help each other. It's a great place to Discord. You can come over and talk all night long, anytime. And there's always people in there shooting the breeze, having fun talking stocks. It's one of the best places in the world to go. Personally, I think it's like a family. So come over and join us. And you know, like I always say, let's get out there and make some money. Oh, my God.